And as promised, our TikTok maker, Donnie Mays, is back doing something really corny. Oh, it is corny. Oh, that was I like that. You like but it? I'm so pretty use it to that <laughs> yeah. So it's not a pie. It's no. not a cake. No, no. It, there's no soft drinks here. It's a new year, so I kind of wanted to go with those. Something, Mix it up a little bit. Yeah, you know, branch out, give you all something a little savory. Of but course, there's some sweet corn in there. No, sweet. That's, well, that's sweet yeah. right there, but it's pretty. It looks like a pretty simple recipe. Yeah, yeah. as always. As always, Keep of course. It simple. That's well, good. Well, walk through. So, uh, first of all, you know, this is very versatile. You could put cheese you could not add a jalapeno it's a souffle okay. it's a souffle it's a yeah. casserole or even um anything you know it's, it's just a cornbread right it's exactly. a cornbread that's what it is you want to call it all right so it's really simple like i said you can use a box of cornbread and this one i actually used honey so you know well, like i said it's, it's versatile so one box of cornbread one cup of sour cream oh mm -hmm, wow mm -hmm, okay mm -hmm. two eggs Two eggs, and I like the way you crack them. Yes, I like of the way course. you crack them. Yeah, that's the way I do it too. You know, if you get a little shell, it's yeah. nutrition. Yeah. Then. Melted one butter. cup of melted, not mm. one cup, I'm sorry, one stick of melted butter. Wow, right. okay, yeah. Butter, so it's butter. rich so far. It, it yeah. is, and just, you want to mix this up, and then... You want me to do that? Yeah, go for Here, it. Go for I'll it. do that while you're talking. Go for it. Okay. And then you can use whole corn, you can use the freezer corn, you can use, you know, fresh corn, whatever you like. Yeah. So, Angie, you're just mixing that up, I and am. I'm going to add one can of Oh, it's sweet drained, but it's corn. drained. That was my, I was it panicking. It is yeah, drained. You want it drained yeah, entirely. Yeah. And then this one is a can of cream corn. So, the whole Thing? This the whole thing. This is kind of the trick here because All it right. makes it creamy. Ooh, that's a rich thing right okay. there. Yes. All right. And then that's you can put it in either aluminum um, foil pan, but make sure you grease it a little bit, or you can put it in a glass, glass baking tree. dish, yeah. or even these souffle cups. And that's what makes it the souffle. And then this is what it is okay, after the fact. Out. Okay. And then Ron, if you want to just do a drizzle of honey. Oh, drizzle. it smells so good. And again, good. that's it optional. Really. You want to give Angie a little honey too. Oh, absolutely. I'll give her a little honey. And there's a little honey. There's honey. Little honey. That's a little honey, honey. Local Posey County honey there. Ah, uh, there you go. I like that. Yes. Get that local so, honey. Now I like that you you did the jalapenos. Yeah, I mean, I would do a little heat on this. Yes. Yeah. How long did you bake that? Though? Now I did bake this actually for one hour at 350 degrees. Okay. And you can find this on my TikTok too. So this is so good, isn't it? So no. I mean, take a bite of that. This is even awesome. With the Where's the chili when I needed it? Yeah, <laughs> yeah it worked Perfect out really time. well. It is. It's sweet. Yes. It's like a sweet cornbread is what yep. it's. So let it bake for an hour and then yeah. pull it out and let it Try sit that. for about a half hour. Let me get, yeah. Let me get like a little. Mm. Hollow Jalapeno. So yeah, yeah, you cut up one jalapeno, right? Just put yeah. just do it on the top. It's yeah. not all throughout. Right. And right. Donnie, here's what I'm I'm really impressed by because there's a lot of liquid ingredients yeah, in yeah. there. But oh, look at good. the inside, you all. Yeah, it's like a I mean, pudding. It's really, you know, really it's like, like a, a pudding. pudding. It's so. Let me get a shot in here. This is so really dense but good. It's mm -hmm. got a great texture. Yes. I'll hold it right there. So, and it's good eating right there. It oh, really is. Great. Some good eating right and there. You can even do green chilies instead of jalapenos ooh, throughout. Ooh. Okay. I did that and it was just it was mm, it was delicious. I like it too. You could yeah. really make it your own. Yeah and of course you know I forgot some seasonings but you add onion powder, a little bit of garlic powder, even parsley just to make it a little pretty because you know parsley doesn't do much but. No but it but it you know Presentation's part of it too. Absolutely. I mean, obviously, the sense of smell, Absolutely. your eyes will tell you if it. But this looks good and it tastes every bit. In fact, yes. it tastes better than I thought. And it's even just as good when it's kind of at room temperature. It, yeah. You know, it doesn't I matter. I mean, it's really good. Yeah, it's right. good either way. Yeah, it's it doesn't really, have to be really good. Hot right out of the oven. About so this is on your TikTok? Is. Yeah, absolutely. You just might have to scroll a little bit, you know, but yeah, it's on there. Maybe I'll pin it to the top. Oh, that'd be good. Because people are going to want to see it. Right, absolutely. I'll pin it to the top. You just go to my profile on TikTok at Kitchen Tool and it'll be right there at the top. Preference, I I like the Pyrex yeah. dish. Is yeah. that your preference? Oh, of course. Yes, I love Pyrex. Yeah. Yep. Especially whenever it comes to this souffle or pudding, I just, I like it in the glass. <laughs> you can see it too. Uh, absolutely. It's good it rises up and it puffs up and then it goes right back down. Yeah. It's, mm. it's great. You're amazing, Donnie Mays. Thank, Thank you, you so much. You can see all the ways to follow him. Get this recipe. So no good. kidding. Oh. Never disappoints. That Never. is really good.